Ja Morant suspended from team activities after a second video circulates him showing a gun. Listen, guys, I've been so upset about this situation because I was like, really? You did it before and now you're doing it again. Why would you be so unaware? Like literally, Memphis Grizzlies guard Ja Morant has been suspended from team activities after Instagram live video appearing to show him flashing a gun while in a vehicle with others circulated on social media on Sunday. Just two months after the athlete was suspended over a similar video based on CNN, Morant is suspended from all activities pending league review. The Grizzlies announced Sunday on Twitter, adding the team had no further comment, you know, this is what he had to say. I know I've disappointed a lot of people who have supported me. Morant said in a statement Tuesday. He also adds that this is a journey and I recognize there is more work to do. My words may not mean much right now, but I take full accountability for my actions. I'm committed to continue working on myself. It is not known when or where the video was shot. NBA Commissioner Adam Silver said Tuesday he was stunned to see the video. We're in the process of investigating it and we'll figure out exactly what happened to the best we can. Silver told ESPN, this video is a bit graining and all that, but I'm but I'm assuming the worst. The commissioner said after the first incident, the two-time All-Star gave him the sense he was taking this incredible seriously. So honestly, I was shocked when I saw this weekend that video. The Grizzlies have not commented since their tweet. In March, the NBA suspended Morant for eight games without pay for conduct detrimental to the league after he was seen in another Instagram Live video holding a gun at a nightclub in Glendale, Colorado, a suburb of Denver. At the time, the league said an investigation did not conclude that the gun at issue belonged to Morant, was brought to him into the nightclub, or was displayed by him beyond a brief period. The investigation also did not find that Morant possessed the gun while traveling with the team or any NBA facility. Listen, guys, Morant met with Silver after the Denver incident. A 23-year-old told ESPN they had an open discussion. Ja Morant's conduct was irresponsible, reckless, and potentially very dangerous, Silver said in a statement. It also has serious consequences given his enormous following and influence, particularly among young fans who look up to him. He has expressed sincere remorse for his behavior. Jamarant also made it clear that, you know, to him, he has learned from this incident and that he understands his obligation and responsibility to the Memphis Grizzlies and the broader NBA community extend well beyond his play on the court. The statement said later in March, Jamarant apologized, telling reporters he received counseling to handle his stress and promising to be more responsible. This is what he said. I'm completely sorry for that. Morant said at the same time. So my job now is, like I said, to be more responsible, more smarter, and don't cause any of that no more. He attributed the incident in part to stress. I went to Florida to counseling to learn how to manage stress, cope with stress in a positive way. Instead of ways I've tried to deal with it before that caused me to make mistakes. Morant was born in South Carolina and attended Murray State University before being drafted by the Grizzlies during the 20. 2019 NBA draft. He was recognized as the NBA rookie of the year at the end of his first season. The Grizzlies seasons ended last month when they were eliminated from the playoffs by the LA Lakers. Guys, I am so upset with him right now because he's so young and he had a bright future. 
I don't know what's going to happen for him because of this incident, because you did it first and now you're doing it again. Like, listen, Morant, you have a family to take care of. Why would God bless you and you do something stupid like this? But God bless you. I hope, you know, you know, things work out for the better, but I think he's definitely wrong. But you guys comment below and let me know what you think about it. Until next time, see you guys in our other video. Bye, guys.